You know, when we have a healthy heart, that helps all of the things in our body to work better. So the heart provides the blood, it pumps the blood around that lets everything else function. Our brain, our muscles, our intestines, all parts of the body. And the heart's able to pump out all the blood that our body needs when it's functioning well. When it isn't functioning well, we develop things like heart failure, for example. But, but first, just to say that when the heart's functioning well, it can meet all the needs of the body. So whether we're sitting at our desk, resting essentially, not needing a great deal of blood flow to our muscles, or whether we're out do it walking at a heart walk or uh, running a marathon uh, in the Olympics, the heart can provide enough blood flow for that. So it can easily triple its blood flow, even uh, you know, in most of us, and in athletes it can increase its blood flow 10 or 12 times. It does that because the, the blood flow to the heart itself increases and the heart muscle itself can work harder. All the parts of the heart have to be in synchrony to do that. There has to be an electrical system that tells the heart that it should beat faster when it needs to. The muscles have to be working, the muscle that, uh, that pumps blood out, a muscle about as big as your fist uh, in the middle of your chest. The uh, valves in the heart have to keep blood flowing the right way. Uh, and uh, and all, of the, all of these come together to function in a way that lets us do all the things we need to do.